How's it going everybody? It's Steve here coming back at again with another video for you all. If you guys are new here, welcome. If you're a returning viewer, I appreciate you watching. I am reviewing one of my favorite spots that I haven't done in a while that I should have done. It's Kenso Social. Unfortunately, I couldn't record outside of it, so I had to come at my house because they had music playing and I don't want to get it copyrighted. So, I'm going to do it here. So what we got here is the Chasu which I'm gonna eat, which is delicious. It's so, so, so good. But, but, probably my favorite though, is the Tori Naban. This thing, this thing is fried chicken, has some pickled cucumbers. I'm not a fan of pickled stuff, but this is pretty good, it's okay. And it, ha it usually has a little bit of mac salad, but my girlfriend didn't want no mac salad. So there's a mac salad in here, but if you like mac salad, salad, it is, it's egg salad? It's egg salad. Oh, I think it's like mac salad though. Yeah, it looks like oh, mac it's egg salad. salad. But Correction, it's egg salad. it is egg salad. But let's try this out. So first, I'm gonna eat this. Look at this. Ooh. Mmm. Wow. See a ton of veggies, and then the rice is right underneath. It's like a good little healthy bowl. It's so good. Let me get let me get a little bite out of this. I think this is a good. Like you're, you want to eat out, but you kind of want to feel healthy at the same time. I think it's a really, really good place. Mm. Mm hmm. Really well seasoned. The white rice, so good. Look, this sauteed. It's delicious. It's so good. Mm. Now, this fried chicken. Oh my god! Look how massive this is. This must have been a massive chicken. Let me try a little bit. Let me hear. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Hope you guys can hear that crunch. Just perfectly. Mm. Oh, yeah. Hope you guys heard that crunch. It's just so good. Definitely got to try this out. Probably one of my favorite places. If I don't know what I want to eat. Definitely just gonna go to Kenzo Social and get one of these two bowls. But now, I gotta show you the boba drinks. So we got the peach bum here. Actually, this is the first time I'm actually ordering this. So, we're gonna try it out. We're gonna try it first time. Oh. Huh. Has a, is that mint? What is that? I don't know what it has, but it's really refreshing really really refreshing always get light ice because if you get regular ice or a ton of ice i just fill this whole thing up with ice and you get less drinks so make sure you get light ice and also you, the first boba drink or the first topping is free they ran out of boba so i had to get crystal boba but it's still good the favorite drink though top drink is asian glow look at that look at the color of this look at that Usually it'll be bo boba balls here, but again, they ran out of boba, so they gotta get crystal boba. But this, this is probably the most refreshing drink they have there. So good. They also got a Vietnamese one. What is it, Uncle Phil? It is very, very caffeinated. It's really, really good, and it has a little, was it cream, the crema, or like, yeah, like the little, there you go, salted cream on top. It's really, really good. Mm -hmm. This thing, this thing's addicting. So definitely try this place out. This is probably, yeah, I will say this is my favorite boba drink of all time. Of right now, currently, my favorite boba drink. It's really, really good. But yeah, let me know what you guys think. Go try this place out. I remember I tried them out when they were first open and they're slowly like picking up, um, but it's really good. Try out, I haven't tried the ramen. I don't know how good the ramen is. I usually just get the rice bowls because this is usually good enough for me. If you try the ramen, let me know. Let me know because I've never tried the ramen. I'm always sticking to the rice bowls, this or your toying on bomb because how can you go wrong with this fried chicken? Look at this. Show us again. Look at that fried chicken. Sorry, so I made another one. Oh, I'm so bad. Mmm. Mmm. Then this. Mmm. That's really good. So. Thank you guys for watching. I make this short and sweet. I'm gonna finish this. It's gonna be really, really good. 
Again, so I got the Chatsu, what I ordered, Tori Nanban, the Peach Bum, and Asian Glow. And my favorites of these four, Tori Nanban, because you can't go wrong with fried chicken. Asian Glow, super, super refreshing, especially in this hot day. Summer's about to wind down. I think that's a really, really great drink. But even if it's not, if it's like winter time, I think it's still really good. But go try them out. It's hidden, so I'll show, like, obviously how to get there. But yeah. But thank you if you like this kind of video. Again, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Appreciate it. Helps the channel out. Helps me out. Let's me know what kind of videos you want. Also, follow me on other social media. See you down as SJ. When I'm posting here, I'm also posting there. So as always, stay safe and take care. Before I let you go, I want to show you where Kenso Social is located since it's a bit hidden. It is on Story Road next to the Walmart inside Little Saigon, right under the 919 sign. Little Saigon has so many nice hidden spots. I might review some more spots here because there are so many options here. This is such a little gem located in Nisai San Jose. If you do happen to try Kenso Social or have food recommendations inside Little Saigon, please comment below. Thank you for watching and see you in the next one.